Uh, I'm Deputy Mayor James Smith, and I'm so pleased to be joined here by Chief Willie Jackson to talk about Fire Prevention Week. Uh, I'd also like to take this opportunity to thank all of the men and women of the Rochester Fire Department for their service, uh, some, some of whom are here today, and we want to thank them for being here, but we also want to thank all of our firefighters for their service each and every day. Uh, it takes a hero to run toward the danger while others run away, and every member of the Rochester Fire Department is indeed a hero. The Fire Department is a city agency ho you hope you'll never need but one you are always happy that is there if you do. And, and 24 hours a day, 365 days a year, our firefighters, command team, and support staff are on duty protecting our families, our businesses, and our property. And for that, on behalf of the citizens of Rochester, I would like to offer my sincere gratitude to our fire department and all of its members. Thank you. We are here today to proclaim October 6th through October 12th as Fire Prevention Week to raise awareness about fire safety and to help ensure that every home and family is prepared in the event of an emergency. As you see on the banner behind me, this year's theme is not every hero wears a cape, plan and escape. And it's so important that all of our, all of our residents and businesses take some time um, you know, they, they, they certainly can take great comfort knowing that the Rochester Fire Department will be there if they need them and that they'll answer the call. But I think it's important and incumbent on all of us where we work and where we live to take a little time and to think about a plan that if the worst happened, if there were a fire in our home or in our workplace, what would we do and, and how would we respond and, and how would we get out because it's so very, very important. And I, I, one of the things I'm very proud of um, the, as it relates to the city of Rochester and specifically our fire department is that we are ISO class one certified and we are also an accredited fire department. Um, there's only 1% of fire departments in the world that can say that. 1% of fire departments in the world are ISO class one certified and accredited. And that's a testament to a, a city that believes in investing in our fire department, but it's really a testament to what these folks do each and every day to keep our citizens safe. Uh, we were very fortunate in, in receiving the ISO Class 1 certification, and when we did, we were told a, 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 a critical component in us getting that designation was our investment in fire prevention. And, and really, any time we can prevent a fire from happening is a good day. Uh, when, when these folks don't have to answer a call, that's a very good day and that's ultimately what we're trying to accomplish because um, while we do a great job at fighting fires and answering those calls, the best thing we can do is not have to answer them at all. Um, as I said, we're going to do a proclamation proclaiming uh, this to be Fire Prevention Week, October 6th or October 12th, and I have that right here signed by Mayor Warren.